Thank you, Madam Chair. This report dismantling the obstacles to EU citizens' rights I think is a very worthwhile report and I think it could prove useful to citizens. I don't agree with everything that's in it, but certainly as a member of the Petitions Committee and indeed in my own general work as an MEP, I'm very conscious of the problems and obstacles that are faced by citizens when they're trying to exercise uh, their, free right, their right to free movement and indeed that of their families as well. Now in this context I voted for the first part of Amendment 1 on freedom of movement to citizens but the second part of Amendment 1 gave me some problems because I had some concerns about its wording when it asked that we recognise freedom of movement for all EU citizens etc. on the basis of mutual recognition. Now, I'm very happy to support Directive 2004-38, where freedom of movement for family members is guaranteed on the basis of legislation of the host member state, but not on any other basis. And I also support that that directive would be strictly applied, as that will eliminate some of the obstacles I spoke of later uh, when people are trying to exercise their rights to free movement. But I'm not prepared to go beyond that.